I ride for really a million different reasons at this point. It started uh, for transportation in high school, and one day I missed the bus, and I so I rode my bike to the shuttle, and I got there before the bus would. One day I realized, well, what if I just ride all the way to school, which was eight miles, it was crazy at the time. And once I did that, it was, it was so liberating that I started riding all over the city and slippery slope from there to, to now it's physical health, mental health, socialization, um, pretty much it just checks every box in my life and I've just gone deeper and deeper into it. In a way it's trapped me because I love it so much I could never stop. But, uh, but also I, I would say like the, the, primary, the primary adjective for cycling to me is, is, is freeing. Um, freedom is, is what I get the very most out of it. When I'm, when I'm riding a bike, there's a lot of thoughts go through your head. Um, but when I'm, when I'm going hard, when I'm doing a hard effort, when I'm going for a KOM or when I was racing, that was the only time in my life that I could sort of look down and realize like, oh, a bunch of time has passed and, and there were no thoughts and I was just in the moment and experiencing that. And I think that's what I'm always looking for out of cycling. It's the only thing in my life where I kind of have that feeling. I'm not looking at the clock. I'm, I'm completely focused and in the moment. Um, and that's what keeps me riding. I've always said there's no wrong way to ride a bike. As long as you're out there, that's, that's the win and that's all I want anybody to take from it. When at the end of a YouTube thing, you can put up a little button and it's like, you know, suggest the next video. Uh, what I really wish I could do was a button that says, close your computer and go for a bike ride. Go, uh, go out there and experience it.